What's up guys, my name is Brandon and Cilio has just recently been released after months and months of development, just lots of teasers on Twitter. And if you don't know what Cilio is, this is basically a real alternative to Cydia that is basically just more modern and much faster than Cydia. So we're gonna run through Cilio, you can see the icon right there. We're gonna run through it, how to get it and all that good stuff in this video. So first off, of course you do need to be jailbroken to get Cilio, this is a Cydia alternative, but unlike most Cydia alternatives in the past or pretty much every Cydia alternative in the past, They've basically been just for non jailbroken devices and people just basically say something like Tweakbox is a Cydia alternative But Cilio is actually a Cydia alternative. It's you know package manager with all of the tweaks and themes and things like that Sources all that good stuff just like Cydia. So of course you do need to be jailbroken You do need to be running the Electra jailbreak on iOS 11 through 11.4 So yeah, let's talk about how you actually get Cilio installed on your device So of course you will need Cydia up and running and this is actually how you install it just like any other package you just go into Cydia and you just go to Cilio. You can just search for it, go to the search bar, type in S-I-L-E-O, and you should see it right there. It is in its beta stage. It's in the second beta right now. You can see it's on version 0.4 beta 2. Now this is just a preview version. It's not the actual full version, so it hasn't officially been released yet, but this is still the beta version. You can get it right now. You don't have to be somebody special. Everybody can download this right now, but of course you should probably expect some bugs. It's been pretty stable for me. I've been using it ever since it did get released last week, and uh, it's been perfectly fine for me. I've actually really enjoyed it and I can actually see it overtaking Cydia in the long run. But anyway, so once you download it on here, you will get the icon on your home screen there, Cilio. And before we go into that, I just wanna mention that if you are running the Uncover jailbreak, you see I do have Uncover right there and Electra right here. So if you are running Uncover instead of Electra, you can actually delete all the files in Uncover by going to Settings and then going down here to Restore Root FS. If you enable that and disable things like load tweaks and all that good stuff, it will actually restore the root file system back to default and then you'll be able to jailbreak perfectly fine with the Electra jailbreak. Now, if you do have trouble getting into a jailbroken state, check the description for multiple things you should be doing, basically just to increase the chance of the jailbreak succeeding. But yeah, this video is not about how to install and troubleshooting and things like that. We're just gonna be talking about Cilio in this video and basically how it functions and how it compares to Cydia. So let's go ahead and open it up right here. And you can see it's very similar in nature to Cydia, especially the bottom part right here. We have our sources, our packages, our search, our featured, and then the news section, which is pretty blank for now, since of course this is still in the preview phase. And the first thing you'll notice about Cilio when you open it up is that it really looks like the App Store, the default App Store in iOS 12. You can see the big bold letters up there. You have like your profile icon right there. You have your packages. You have these big pictures right here that basically advertise for you know certain packages as well. So it looks very similar to the stock iOS 12 app store and that was pretty much the whole point of this. It's just a very modern look. And you'll also notice pretty much instantaneously that it is much faster than Cydia. Of course, Cydia was built a long time ago. It's still running on very old infrastructure. So it is just slow in nature, but that is not the case with Cilio. Cilio, Cilio is just much faster in general, you know, from loading up the actual application itself to installing packages to searching, just everything in Cilio is much faster than Cydia. So you can see we have the same verbiage as the App Store as well. We have like get next to the package name. So if we just go into a package here, like better settings, you can see it shows you some screenshots of what it's like. So it looks like you could just, you know, set a background for your settings. It tells you everything you can do. You can customize the settings app and things like that. It shows you all of the details right down here, the developer, the price, when it was released, all that good stuff. And if you go ahead and press on get right here, you can see it will add it to the queue instantly. You can see right there, and it does have a depends on this package right here. So it's really awesome that it shows us that before we actually try to install it and get an error, it shows us that instantly. So we can just simply go ahead and delete it just like that, no problem. So if we go back to cool CC right here and click on get, you can see right now we have another package right here. So we have a cool CC and preference loader. And if we go ahead and click on confirm, you can see we'll actually start the process right here. You can show details. You can actually minimize this as well. While it's actually going through the process, you can be multitasking and going to find other packages and things like that while it's actually installing, which is really cool. And you guys saw how quick that actually finished up right there. Super, super quick. Probably, you know, at least four to five times faster than Cydia, at least. And if we want to restart the springboard, we can simply do that right there. Very quick and easy, just very similar to Cydia. Again, just much faster, better laid out, and things like that. So another thing I like is the auto queue, which you saw right there as well. Let's go back into here. So I like how it auto queues everything instantly. It just doesn't start downloading exactly what you press right away. It just adds it to a queue. So you can install, download and install everything at one time. So let's just go ahead to a couple things. We're just gonna do Sentai Basic right here. 
We're gonna do uh, just some random packages, Felicity right here. So you can see it instantly queued those two packages and they're not gonna download until I actually press confirm. So it's gonna download everything at the same time just to make everything much quicker. And again, it's much better for multitasking now that this is a feature. And if you go to our sources right here, of course you can add all of these sources in here that you want to. You can add the same sources that you added over in Cydia as well. And pretty much every single package from Cydia, you can also download with Cilio. Now, if you did have a purchase package, you will need to go to your profile right here and sign in to the Cydia store to download anything you had purchased inside of Cydia. And just to show you that all the packages are here, if we go to the big boss repo right here, and if we just go down to tweaks right here or themes, you can go to either one. I'm just gonna go to tweaks for this uh, right here just to show you. So if we go to tweaks, you can see there's over 2000 tweaks here. These are all the ones that you would find in Cydia as well. So you don't have to worry about missing out on certain things that are only in Cydia and not in Cilio because it's gonna all be here as well. So I just wanted to show you guys what happens when you try to download a paid tweak that you may have bought from Cydia you know, years ago or months ago or maybe just the other day. If you have it here on Cilio, you'll notice that if you, it shows paid right there. And if you click on that, it shows could not initiate purchase. This repo does not support Cilio purchase. So you're going to notice that some repos do not support Cilio's way of purchasing and managing tweaks that have been bought. So this is something you will need to sign in for. So again, if you go back to the featured page and go to the profile up here, this is where you sign in to your Cydia store and that's where you'll be able to download those packages. Now, just because you have Cilio on your device does not mean you can't use Cydia. You can also use Cydia at the same time. Now, obviously it doesn't really make a ton of sense to just use both and download packages from both. Uh, it's good to, you know, maybe just use one and manage all your packages in one so you don't have to keep going back and forth through applications. But of course, you can't delete Cydia. So that's one thing, you know, you may still opt to use Cydia and that's fine. I mean, Cydia is just, you know, very familiar for a lot of people and it's something, again, you can't delete. So Cydia still may be the way to go for some people. But for me, I actually really prefer Cilio. I love the layout of it. I love how quick it is. I love how it's easy to multitask and it queues your packages up right away. I just love everything about Cilio. And I think this is a very, very strong competitor to Cydia. And I can definitely see this overtaking Cydia with time. Of course, Sorik is kind of phasing out of the whole Cydia thing. He's losing money. Uh, it doesn't seem like it's really on the up and up these days. So I would not be surprised in a couple years to see Cilio being the main you know, package manager that's installed with jailbreaks and Cydia is just no longer installed with a jailbreak. So that's just my take here on Cilio. I hope you guys did enjoy it. And let me know if you guys have downloaded Cilio and what you think about it. Again, I love it. I love that you can actually use something besides Anemone as well. This is one thing I forgot to mention. So if you use a theme, you can actually install themes without Anemone. So Snowboard is the theming engine you can use instead of Anemone if you want to. So this is just an alternative. Uh, again, there's not really gonna be much difference. You can see right here, it's basically just a lightweight successor to Winterboard. I still prefer to use Anemone personally, but some people have used Snowboard and it's cool that there is now an alternative if you wanted to just try it out. And again, it is more recent than Anemone, so it is gonna be built better for something like Cilio. So that is just something to keep in mind as well. But yeah, I just wanted to share with you guys how Cilio has been running. I just wanted to talk to you guys about Cilio. I wanted to use it for a couple days before making a video on it and showing you how to use it. But if you have any questions at all, if you have any opinions on Cilio, let me know down in the comment section below. I'm really interested to see what you guys think about this. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe for a lot more future jailbreak videos. So thanks again for watching guys, and I'll see you soon.